Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and today I'll be doing a smoky eye tutorial so I hope you enjoy. So the first thing I'm going to be using is a primer and I'm using the pore professional one from Benefit and I'm using the contour brush from Real Techniques and I'm just placing that first in the areas where I need it most and then all over the rest of my face. Then for foundation I am using a uh, Max Pro Longwear and um, for some reason I didn't show it and I also didn't show the concealer which is also Pro Longwear. So I'm just blending that all over um, and going over any areas that need more coverage. Here I'm doing my concealer um, with the same brush um, under my eyes, around my nose, on my chin and then over any blemishes just patting it on right onto the blemish and then I blend it in just here. And it's actually quite a nice brush, brush to use for that. Um, from powder I'm using Hello Flawless from Benefit. Um, and just a small powder brush all over the face and I'm using this blush and I can't remember what it's called but it's from Natural Collection and I'll have it listed um, with the products on my blog which I link to below and for my highlight I'm using the highlight from NYX's Highlight and Contour Powder Duo um, just that one there and placing it on the tops of my cheekbones and then for my primer, I'm using a mineral eyeshadow primer from e.l.f. And if you haven't seen, I did a battle of the brands of this against um, Benefit, I think it was. The Benefit stayed on stray. Then for my eyeshadow, I'm taking Slate from the Lorac Pro Palette. If you have the Urban Decay Naked Palette, you can use um, the Gunmetal shade from that palette. It's very similar. Then I'm taking a clean 275 brush and just blending out the edge of that. Then taking the Creep and it's next to that Gunmetal shade. They're actually from the Naked palette. I'm placing that in the outer corner and into the crease to add some definition. Then using Buck from the Naked palette and a fluffy brush, I'm using that to blend out that creep shade, uh, so like a transition color. And then as my highlight, I'm using a matte cream shade um, from the Dirac Pro palette, just um, on the brow bone. Then taking the edge of the um, brush I used for the slate color, just running that along the lower lash line. And then slightly blending it out with a fluffy brush then i'm using the perversion 24 7 pencil from urban decay and lighting my bottom and top water lines and then also along the top lash line i'm just stretching out my eye there just to avoid any skipping and i'm using my picky finger because i had shadow on the other ones and then taking the black from the lorac pro palette and the edge of my shadow brush just blending out that liner then I'm using my trusty Rimmel Dark Brown Brow Pencil to fill in my brows. I'm brushing through and then I'm curling my lashes and applying mascara and I believe I'm using the L'Oreal um, Full Definition Voluminous Mascara there. Then as a lipstick I'm taking Milani's Naturel number 8 um, which is like a brownie nudie colour. Uh, well not need really a nudie or just a brony shade <laughs> um, and that is the look completed i hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to give a thumbs up down below don't forget to leave any comments with your comments questions or requests um and thanks for watching and here's all the places you can find me so don't forget to check out my blog for all the products used and extra pictures and information and stuff so thanks for watching and i'll see you very soon bye